What separates us from the animals? It used to be that I thought that we can use tools and we can use fire, but some new research indicates something different. In parts of Australia, particularly more rural areas, it has been reported that certain birds, particularly raptors or predatory birds, uh, have been intentionally starting fires in order to, or rather spreading fires in order to uh, hunt their prey. And this is a little scary. So like I said, it was once believed that people were the ones that understood how to control and manipulate fire, to use it as a weapon. But according to new research in a paper published in the Journal of Ethnobiology, uh, flare-ups are being caused by these birds, particularly what they're doing. They're not starting the fire themselves with two sticks and their little bird talons, uh, but they are finding <laughs> pre-existing fires, uh, swooping over, grabbing a flaming stick, and then throwing it somewhere else in order to flush out prey, such as mice or lizards or other small animals, and catch them. And there's no evidence they're barbecuing them, but this is at least to catch them. <laughs> so at least they're not cooking their food yet. So this research just came out. Um, there were many accounts in this from different people from parts of Australia, in the north, in the west, uh, who were in particular Australian firefighters and also several aboriginal accounts um, were talking about watching this happen. They don't have very much photo or video evidence of this happening, unfortunately, which is a little hole in the research. This is attributed to the dangers of conducting research on the outskirts of a spreading wildfire. Eusen, who is Dick Eusen, who is one of the people who contributed, did add one black and white photo, but it's not that great. Um, so this is mostly all from accounts of people. So the, the concept of fire spreading raptors is established. It's been uh, um, reported on at least four continents and observed for decades on the edge of big flames. Uh, so what they, they're waiting out scurrying rodents and then trapping them further for, as an example of just one way this is happening. The paper says it's a feeding frenzy because out of these grasslands come small birds, lizards, insects, everything fleeing in front of a fire. They also found um, from Bonta and Gosford, Mark Bonta, two of the paper writers found was that the idea of a fire spreading was well known and accepted among residents, particularly aboriginals in rural Northern Australia. And they have 12 12 separate Aboriginal groups uh, making first-hand reports of this with three different species of raptor in particular are looking at the black kite, the whistling kite, and the brown falcon were identified as the arsonist birds in this situation. It's a little scary considering when fires spread in the wild and firefighters try to stop it, there's one group that's actively working against them and it's birds who aren't really known for their deductive reasoning power. Um, I think more research might be needed for this, but it does seem to be pretty well established among people. Audience, have you ever seen an animal commit a crime? Please let us know below and please like and subscribe for more.